you're looking for some fast, cheap, and reliable India Live mobile coins, go on ahead and head to the coin sponsor at www.mmoorock.com. Use the promo code KEEP to get you 6% off your next purchase. You heard me? What is up, you two? It's your boy Keek Nation, and we back at it again with another video. Now, today I had an idea, and I went, I searched up if anybody else has done this video, and it looks like to me only one guy has done this video, this type of video. It's this guy, it's this guy called So Flow Gods. So, if I do remember, I will put the link to his video in here because I don't want to take credit for somebody else's video. Even though this video was made eight months ago, I'm still gonna give bro credits. I'm still gonna give bro credits because he deserves it. He's the first guy to do this video. So you guys seen from the thumbnail, you guys seen from the uh whatever made you click on this video, you seen it. You seen it today. We are doing the top 10 best dunkers on NBA Live Mobile. Now I don't know what in the world gave me this idea. I have I have absolutely no idea why I had the idea to uh, do this, but thankfully I actually did. Thankfully I actually did have the idea for this video. Now a couple of honorable mentions who I'm going to name right off the top who are not going to be in here are actually my defensive lineup. Bernard King will be an honorable mention because he does dunk a lot and he dunks efficiently and he dunks on top of people. Shaquille O'Neal with that end of pain ability, that end of pain to dunk on anyone. And uh, what's his name? Spud Webb and the small ball and will be honorable mention. And the only reason why he is not on this list because I have not ever had his card. So I cannot speak and say he's a top 10 dunker when I have never played with his card. This is all going to be cards that I have played with, cards that I've had on my team, and cards that I can give you an honest opinion on their top 10 or the ability to dunk on this game. I can't give you an opinion on a card I've never had, you know what I'm saying? So I'm not going to do that. But kicking it off with the number 10 spot in the top 10 list, we got that boy Dominique Wilkins. Oh no. Here we go. Why does it? Oh, okay, I'm tripping. Get the boy Dominique Wilkins. Now, I will say the two-way one is a little bit of a better dunker than the uh, big man one. But to me, they're pretty much the same. The 2A1 does dunk a little bit better. But in general, this Dominique Wilkins, I'm telling you, bro, he be he be slamming on fools. He be slamming on dudes. Like, I'm telling you, it is a little bit better than the uh, big man one. Now, I have never played with the small ball uh, Dominique Wilkins. If they have him up, I know they have a small ball Dominique Wilkins. But why does this car look extra cool? Like... This card didn't used to look that cool. <laughs> this card, like, card art, card art looks, like, a lot better than when I had it. But, like, yeah, this card, he just absolutely slams on fools. He reverse dunks. If he could go between the legs, he would. They don't got women, but, like, the reverse dunks and all the powerful dunks and on top of people dunks that he does are absolutely crazy. Now, moving on to the ninth spot. Moving on to the ninth spot, we got a semi-rare card, a card that you would not see in a lot of people's line, but we got that boy Larry Nance, not junior, but Larry Nance Sr. Oh, what, they got small ball Larry Bird out? I want this card. Time out, yo, one second. Anyway, yeah, so they got that boy Larry Nance, right? Now, this card is one of my favorite cards on this game. Because this is the first legend that I ever pulled out of a pro pack. The first legend, the only other one I ever pulled was a guy named, uh, is, I forgot his name, but he was a point guard for the shooting lineup and he was a 90 overall. But this is the first legend that I pulled. I sold him for about two mil back when one mil the NBA was going for about $5. So I was, that was crazy. But I ended up, I was keeping him. I kept him for the longest. I kept him for like two, three weeks. And then I ended up selling him for some reason. I can't remember who came out, but somebody came out who I sold him. But I'm telling I was throwing alley-oops to this car like it was nothing. Like just straight alley-oop after alley-oop after alley-oop. This car catches bodies. He will catch you mid-air, reverse jams, double pump, clutch dunks, anything you can think of. This car will slam on you. On you. Now, next up. 
Next up, one, another one of my favorite cards on here. We got to go with that boy, Russell Westbrook, your team of the week, Russell Westbrook. Now, this card, for some reason, slams a lot more than any other any other, other Russell Westbrook's. Now, another card that I say could match up with this Russell Westbrook is the uh, Legend one. The Legend, the Legend Russell Westbrook, he slams a lot. And he slams on people. But this, for some reason, this card acts like there is no such thing as a layup. Like to him, there is no such thing as a layup. No. When he steps in the paint, he's slamming the ball. There's no doubt about it. When he steps foot in the in the paint, he's slamming the ball hard. Like some real Russell Westbrook stuff. Now moving on to the next spot. This is our seventh spot. We got that boy Dwayne Wade. We got that boy Dwayne Wade. And in particular, I'm talking about his big man card. Not, not this uh, 90 overall, but the 93 big man, Dwayne Wade. I'm going to see if he's up. This one right here. Uh, Semi-rare card. I actually like this card a lot. It, this is all-star card. It's not, ever, it's not ever like a throwback that far. It's a throwback to uh, 2010. That's pretty long ago. But that boy Dwayne Wade, this card, this card right along with the uh, Russell Westbrook, uh, them being like more take it in, less shooting three-pointer type, type of guards. Of course, EA is going to boost up their in, in the paint abilities. And this dude, Dwayne Wade, in the paint is absolutely crazy. The reverse jams, the double pump jams, and this, he just slams at a high rate. Like, I'd say about 85% of the layups that he will attempt in the paint are going to be dunks. Like, if he's at the free throw line and you press shoot, he's going to dunk it. If you're coming in with some steam, you're holding the, uh, the uh, boost button, he's going to dunk it. Like, I'm telling you, this Dwayne Wade card is crazy. He's in our seventh spot. Now, moving on to our sixth spot, we got that boy Tracy McGrady. Of course, you're going with the 94 overall. Now, for some reason, I would say the two-way one dunks a lot more often than any other card. I don't know why. They all they all have the same stats. They're all the same card. But the two-way one, for me, is the one that I would say slams the most. Like, it dunks the most often. And why is it going for, like, 9 mil? What the heck? Two-way Tracy's going for a lot. It thing going for, like, 8 mil right now. But anyways, this Trace McGrady card is pretty beastly because... Just how often and how much he slams. If you take it to the paint, that boy Tracy McGrady, he was in my top 10 something. Other time, he's in the been a lot of my times. But he's six foot eight at the shooting guard position. So most of the time he's gonna have a six foot four person, somebody who's six three, six six. So he's gonna beat his man to the paint every time. And he's dunking on him. It's Tracy McGrady. If you all right, all right, watch this. Come on, bro. You you seen that, right? You don't you don't think Trace McGrady gonna be out here dunking on people? Trace McGrady is a monster. Trace McGrady is a monster. That is our sixth spot. Moving on to the fifth spot, we get the boy LeBron. And I'm gonna tell you why this card is in the top five. Basically, you can't stop him. He's six foot eight, two hundred and fifty pounds of pure muscle. And when he gets to the paint. LeBron James is going to dunk the ball. There's no doubt about it. It's no if, buts, or ands. He's going to dunk the ball. Best believe it. It's down packed. It's down packed. There's no stopping it. I don't care if you got a Shaq in the paint. I don't care if you got a Bill Russell. I don't care if you got Rudy Gobert. Whoever 99 overall card that you got in there, LeBron James is going to slam on him. Facts. There is no stopping him. There is no stopping LeBron in this game. Why? I don't even know. Especially the fact that he has a 99 card now. And like before, he, he only had like a 96. And those cards were unstoppable. This card is immovable. He's like a juggernaut. There's no stopping this card at all. Now moving on to the fourth spot. We got that boy Blake Griffin. Now personally, I love this card. We got all-star Blake Griffin. Sorry for the... uh. In between bids. Uh, next bid, I'm gonna just put 3.2 mil, something like that. We got that boy Blake Griffin, right? And this boy Blake Griffin is an absolute monster. Let me put a higher bid on here. This dude keep playing with my emotion. Like your boy Kike ain't got the coins up there. Let 
I will keep that So this Blake Griffin call right here, I'm telling you, he's like Larry Nance. He's going to catch a lot more alley-oops because he can't really dribble. So he's, it's going to be a little harder to get him to paint because he, he, he does have that dribbling defect. You know, he can't really dribble like that. But I'm telling you, once you get this card successfully in the paint, it's over. It's over. It's over. Only thing that can stop this man is no one. There's no stopping Blake Griffin once he gets in the paint. He's catching a body. Like he's 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 he really jumps hecka high. He catches bodies. He's unstoppable. He's immovable. Blake Griffin is just pure destruction in the paint. Crazy. Alley oops after alley oops. It's absolutely crazy how much this car dunks. How often this car dunks. If you don't believe me, he only about 3-4 mil. Go ahead and try him out. Go ahead and cop him. Moving on to, what's this, the third spot. We got that boy, 99, Sean Kemp. Now, a lot of y'all should have this card, as I would expect a lot of y'all to have this card. He only going for about 3 mil, but this boy, Sean Kemp. Sean Kemp is absolutely no joke. One of my favorite cards in this game man like Sean Kemp at the center now he is only see only 6'10 so he's at the tallest center but he makes up for what he doesn't have in height with jumping ability this boy has ups he's dunking on everyone he's grabbing every board but his reverse he reverse dunks like it's nothing the reverse dunks are crazy he reverse dunks so often it's kind of crazy it's a little ridiculous how much he reverse dunks like really like Kobe Bryant reverse dunk type of stuff now we're gonna keep on with this list we're not gonna make this uh too long next on we got 99 events I'm not really gonna go too in depth why Vince Carter is on this list I'm gonna just say just like this it's Vince Carter one more time one more time it's Vince Carter if he's not on your top 10 of any kind of dunk list except for if you're doing for some reason the top 10 worst dunkers then he shouldn't be in there but come on it's vince carter this card is absolutely crazy he reverse dunks double pumps dunks dunks on you dunks on centers put it back dunk he's he's the only card i've ever had that has automatically did a reverse a reverse put back dunk i shot the ball with who i had uh with uh jamal crawford this dude vince carter comes out of absolutely nowhere grabs the ball and reverse slams it crazy crazy now first on the list first on this list you got a gameplay coming out with this ray allen but first on the list we got that boy julius irving now it is one decider that brings him a little bit over vince now a lot over vince one he is the best card in this game and secondly he can get you four to three in the paint abilities a game that is four dunks four automatic dunks in the game especially depending on what type of game mode you're on if you're doing like one of those summer summer uh courts summer court game where you have to go like 21 he's probably gonna have like like five to six in the paint abilities if you're doing a head-to-head -head, you can probably gonna get to three to four if you're doing a season game he's probably doing like like 12 12 to 14 in the paint dunk abilities automatically and without that he dunks on pretty much anyone if you don't believe me go to my uh gameplay on julius Irvin. he was just slamming like he was every time i went to the paint he dunked the ball every single time i went to the paint he dunked the ball like i'm telling you it's crazy it's crazy y'all that is our number one spot for the best dunkers on nba live mobile once again let me give the credit to that boy his, his name is so flow gods you guys not sub to him make sure you guys go sub to him i don't know if he still does uh nba live videos let me check when his last post was okay yeah he still he still does videos his last his last video was 2k 2k 18 or prelude he got uh 3k subscribers so everybody go subscribe to that boy everybody go subscribe to that boy uh crash him for the uh for being the first person to do best dunkers on nba live mobile but that was a while ago but your boy kick out to do one. Your boy kick out to do one. Tell me what you thought. Tell me who's y'all favorite dunker on the game. Tell me who y'all think is a better dunker than my top one. Because there's, there's no one better than Julius Everett. That's what, there's no one better than Julius Everett. But besides from all that, I'm going to go ahead and turn on that outro. 
make sure you guys sub to my uh, NBA channel. I already made the video. I would have shot it out yesterday, but I cannot make custom thumbnails until I get my uh, channel monetized. So I'm waiting on the, I'm waiting on uh, I'm waiting on AdSense to hit me back up to see if my uh, application has been accepted. So I'm waiting on my videos to be monetized. That way I can do my custom thumbnails and everything will be all gravy in the Navy. But besides from all that, I'm gonna turn on the outro and we out. Maybe get you drunk, maybe high too. Maybe fall in love, maybe fall in love. I could take you to the other side, yeah. Show you that there's